Phonutria, commonly known as Brazilian wandering spiders, armed spiders, or banana spiders, are a genus of aggressive and venomous spiders of potential medical significance to humans. They are mainly found in tropical South America, with one species in Central America. These spiders are members of the Ctenidae family of wandering spiders. The Brazilian wandering spiders appear in Guinness World Records from 2010 as the world's most venomous spider. Guinness World Records states that although the Brazilian wandering spider is the most toxic, an effective antivenom is available and few fatalities occur. Description: The genus Phonutria contains eight scientifically described species. The most notorious being P. A. Fira and P. A. nigraventa. The spiders in the genus can grow to have a leg span of 13 to 15 cm. Their body length ranges from 17 to 48 cm. While some other Araneomorph spiders have a longer leg span, the largest Phonutria species have the longest body and the greatest body weight in this group. The genus is distinguished from other related genera such as Ctents by the presence of dense prolateral scopulae on the pedipalp tibiae and tarsi in both sexes. Phonutria are easily confused with several other non medically significant ctenids, especially Cupionius, in which the recently described C. chypernensis also has bright red hairs on the chelicerae. Additionally, some Phonutria species lack red hairs on the chelicerae, making it an unreliable identification feature. The presence of a dark linear stripe or stripes on the frontal palps and presence of a single thin black line running anterior-posterior along the dorsal carapace may help identify phonutria. Other features are the strong ventral marking on the underside of the legs with contrasting dark mid-segments and lighter joints, and the pattern on the ventral of the abdomen with several rows of black dots, or an overall reddish color. The characteristic defensive posture with frontal legs held high is an especially good indicator to confirm a specimen as phonutria, especially alongside correct color patterns. During the defensive display the body is lifted up into an erect position, the first two pairs of legs are lifted high, while the spider sways from side to side with hind legs in a cocked position. Behavior Wandering spiders are so-called because they wander the jungle floor at night rather than residing in a lair or maintaining a web. During the day they hide inside termite mounds, under fallen logs and rocks, and in banana plants and bromeliads. P. A. nigraventa is known to hide in dark and moist places in or near human dwellings. P. A. nigraventa mates during the dry season from April to June, which leads to frequent observations of the species during this time. Distribution Phonutria are found in forests from Costa Rica and throughout South America east of the Andes into northern Argentina, including Colombia, Venezuela, the Guianas, Ecuador, Peru, Bolivia, Brazil and Paraguay. Three species are found in the Amazon region, one species is restricted to the Amazon, and one ranges into Central America in Panama and Costa Rica. The remaining species are restricted to Atlantic forest of Argentina, Paraguay and Brazil, including forest fragments in the Cerrado savanna. In Brazil, Phonutria is only absent in the northeastern region north of Salvador, Bang. Phonutria has been introduced to Chile and Uruguay. Species As of early 2012, this genus contains eight species, Phonutria baeensis cima cubed and Bree scovit, 2001 a Euro-Atlantic rainforest of Brazil. Phonutria bolivensis a Euro-Central, South America, Phonutria Aixteti Martins and Batani, 2007 a Euro Brazil, Phonutria Firaperti, 1833 a Euro Ecuador, Peru, Brazil, Suriname, Guyana, Phonutria Kieselinga a Euro Atlantic rainforest of Brazil, Phonutria Nigraventa a Euro Brazil, Northern Argentina, introduced to Uruguay, Phonutria Perti a Euro Atlantic rainforest of Brazil. Phonutria renidae a Euro Venezuela, Peru, Brazil, Guyana. Toxicity in prey, P. fira and P. nigraventa are widely considered the most venomous species of spider. Its venom contains a potent neurotoxin, known as PHTX3, which acts as a broad spectrum calcium channel blocker that inhibits glutamate release, calcium uptake, and also glutamate uptake in neural synapses. At deadly concentrations, 
This neurotoxin causes loss of muscle control and breathing problems, resulting in paralysis and eventual asphyxiation. In addition, the venom causes intense pain and inflammation following a bite due to an excitatory effect the venom has on the serotonin 5-HT4 receptors of sensory nerves. This sensory nerve stimulation causes a release of neuropeptides such as substance P which triggers inflammation and pain. Aside from causing intense pain, the venom of the spider can also cause priapism in humans. Erections resulting from the bite are uncomfortable, can last for many hours and can lead to impotence. A component of the venom is being studied for use in erectile dysfunction treatments. The amount of P. nigroventa venom necessary to kill a 20 AG mouse has been shown to be only 6 AI 1 quarter G intravenously and 134 AI 1 quarter G subcutaneously as compared to 110 AI 1 quarter G and 200 AI 1 quarter G respectively for Latrodectus mactans. This ranks phonutrial venom among the most deadly spider venoms to mice. The Brazilian wandering spider's prey also includes crickets, katydids, mantids, and other larger animals, including tree frogs and lizards. Danger to humans, the genus Phonutrial includes some of the relatively few species of spiders known to present a threat to humans. Danger to humans is not merely a question of toxicity, but requires the capacity to deliver the venom, a sufficient quantity of venom, a disposition that makes a bite likely in proximity to human habitation. The actual incidence of death or serious injury must also be considered. Spider mouth parts are adapted to envenom very small prey. They are not well adapted to attacking large mammals such as humans. Some experts believe that various spiders like Phonutria can deliver a dry bite to purposely conserve their venom, as opposed to a more primitive spider like Atrex that usually delivers a full load. A study in March 2009 suggests that Phonutria inject venom in approximately one third of their bites and only a small quantity in one-third of those cases. Another study similarly suggested that only 2.3% of bites were serious enough to require antivenom. Other studies, as cited in the Wolfgang Bar one-quarter shale studies, showed that the toxicity of phonutrial venom was clearly more potent than both Latrodectus and Atrax. Research in this area is hindered by the difficulty of identifying particular species. Nevertheless, there are well attested instances of death. In one case, a single spider killed two children in Tsar Poundo Sebastia Poundo. The spider was positively identified as a phonutria by Wolfgang Bar one quarter shell. Despite their reputation as the world's deadliest spiders, there are multiple studies that call into question their capacity for fatal human envenomation, though some of these are labeled with a level of uncertainty as phonutria are often confused with other genera of ctenids, lycosids or other large labored and other spiders. Of the eight described species, P. A. nigraventa and P. A. fira most frequently received mention in mass media publications. P. A. nigraventa is the species responsible for most cases of venom intoxication in Brazil because it is commonly found in highly populated areas of southeastern Brazil, such as the states of Zao Pão Paulo, Minas Gerais, Rio de Janeiro and Espirito Santo. The species P. A. Fira is native to the northern portion of South America in the Amazon of Brazil, Venezuela, Ecuador, Peru and the Guyanas. The spider's wandering nature is another reason it is considered so dangerous. In densely populated areas, Phonutria species usually search for cover and dark places to hide during daytime, leading it to hide within houses, clothes, cars, boots boxes and log piles, thus generating accidents when people disturb it. Its other common name, banana spider, comes from its tendency to hide in banana bunches or plantations, and it is occasionally found as a stowaway within shipments of bananas. These spiders can also appear in banana crates sent to grocery stores and bulk food centers around the world. One such instance happened in 2005 with a shipment of bananas arriving at Bridgewater, England, when a man was bitten by a P. fearer. Due to quick medical care he survived, taking nearly a week to recover from the bite following treatment. Footnotes External links